Okay, so this is the tank that uh, Ethan designed and we built together. <clears throat> he drew up some ideas and then I uh, sheared the plate. It's made entirely out of one eight inch thick steel, mild steel plate. Um, it weighs 42 pounds. Uh, it ha it's pa the, the tracks are made out of a double 50 series industrial chain. The sprockets are, I think, 13 tooth sprockets, just single run on the inside track, and then there's just one inch pipe that's the rollers in the different areas to keep the chain uh, running smoothly. Inside, let's take a look. So we've got our controller here, which just uses uh, switches. And let's see, inside the tank, we have. Uh, there are two 12 volt batteries and those are wired in uh, in series so that they yeah no parallel yeah wired parallel so it's 12 volts total and then we've got two motors inside there connected to the sprockets the drive sprockets on either side and these were surplus motors that came out of uh, uh, children's ride on vehicles I'm not sure exactly what type but I got them at Surplus Center, they weren't too bad of a price. So like I said, it's uh, 42 pounds. It's got 12 volts, and those batteries, they're for the uh, emergency battery backup supply for fire alarms and the emergency lights uh, on campus, and we just have a bunch of them. When they get to 85% charge health, battery health, they just throw them away. So I just pulled these ones out of the stack, and hopefully they should keep enough charge to do something that's not quite as as crucial so have it on this uh... This poster board as a So yeah, there it is.